we're back out chasing that 11 inch bluegill it is zero degrees out and 20 mile an hour winds so it's not exactly the ideal day to be out but at the same time I can't catch fish sitting on the couch right there's something got what we got oh look at that crappie midday crappie oh looks like there's more fish down there too got them on that little three miller jig three millimeter jig getting down there there's fish down there fish down there oh there's a bunch of fish down there i wonder i bet they're crappies they're all crappies There we go, another fish. Nice crappie. Oh, oh there he is. <laughs> Look at that. Another nice crappie. I'm keeping fish today, just so everybody knows. <clears throat> oh, there's more fish down there. Come on, boys. There we go. This is probably a gill. Yep. Oh, there's a nice one. Ooh, it goes come off. Oh. He's probably nine inches. Yeah. There's a fish. But that's a gill. Oh, there's a bobber. Woods. Bobber just went down over here. See that? Got it. Whatever it is. This probably be a crappie. Big slow head shake on it. Probably feels like a nice crappie. There we go. There's a solid fish right there, everybody. So I'm dead sticking over here. I got just a plain red gamma gatsu hook with a little crappie minnow. And I see fish coming through, you know, up higher on that 14 foot area. And so I'm picking off crappies and bluegills both. This is a nice crappie. This one's right about at the limit I, I go for keeping fish. You know, this one's probably, oh, I don't know. Let's find out. Should we just find out? I got off the noon to fish, so I don't like keeping anything over 12 inches. So this crappie right here is, there we go. Well, if I punch his mouth together. This crappie right here is, is 11 and a half, maybe 11 and a quarter. That is a heck of a nice crappie. You know, I like to keep them bigger than 12. So these, I got two of them that are probably right around that. That one's probably 11, 11 and a half. That one's probably 10 and a half, close to 11. Two decent gills. Oh, oh, there's a fish. Got my bobber over here. Uh, guessing this is a crappie. There we go. Oh. No. This is a big fish, whatever it is. Big. Big fish. Definitely not a crappie. I don't know what the heck was going on with that. Because I had... I had crappies and stuff over here on the other side of the graph, and this bobber just started sinking. It's got to be a pike, maybe a bass. This fish, I mean, I'm not, it's pretty hard to move them. If you guys are like me, I sure love eating pike too. Holy!
<laughs> oh my gosh, I am soaked. <laughs> I am soaked. This is a, this is a nice pike. This is probably five pounder. Huh? Look at my look at my hook set too. Gosh, he he rolled in my line like you wouldn't believe. Oh, I didn't even I didn't even get a chance to. Woo, didn't even get a chance to uh, try to play him. He comes shooting up that hole like a like he was a jumping jack. That hook, that thing's barely in there too. But I could just touch it with about anything and it'll come out. Corner of my hook, so that. See that? There we go, look at that. Hook's gone. Man. Well, that's sweet. Bonus fish. Yeah, I'll be keeping them too. You know, why? Why not? Pike is good eating, especially if you can uh, get them Y bones out of there. It's a good solid fish. He won't be down there trying to scare all my crappies away now. Mm. Sweet. There's one. That's a nice one. Oh, another really nice eater. Probably right around that eight and a half to nine inch size. There's one. I don't know. Oh, this one here. Oh, look at that guy. Oh, that is a huge bluegill. Though. Oh, we've got a whole school down here now, guys. You know what? I'm going to let this this last one here. He's probably a 10-incher. I'm going to let him go. He's just too big. <clears throat> i got a bunch of fish down there right now. Oh, there's, my, there's a fish on my minnow over here. Not sure what it is, but we're about to find out. Got it, whatever it is. I bet it's, oh, it's a bluegill. I'll bet. Oh, it's crappie. I was wrong. Ha! Fighting like a bluegill, though. There we go. Down over here. Got it, whatever it is. Probably gonna be a crappie. Yep, look at that. Well, trying to get some sunfish. So we already got our limited crappies. So he can go bye bye. crappie but I can't keep it there buddy bam this is nice whatever it is oh it's, there's a big bluegill oh my gosh look at this oh Look at the size of this thing. All right, I'm not. I'm. I'm gonna set this thing off to the side because there's a bunch of fish down there. You know what? I'm gonna throw them in with my minnows. All right, there's fish down there, but I want to take care of this. I want to take care of this bluegill. <clears throat> He's okay. He's in the bucket over here. All right. Look at the size of that monster. 
I gotta get a picture of them. I have to. Whoa! Oh, sorry there, buddy. I'm going back in the water, but. All right, so this bluegill right here is at least 10 inches. It's 10 inch bluegill. There he goes. Gone. Well, we didn't get the 11 inch bluegill today, but we got a limited crappie, a bunch of a bunch of nice bluegills we kept. We threw back two that were 10 inches, or is it three? I don't know. And then we got a northern that's probably, I'm guessing, around 28 inches. Anyway, what a fantastic day on the ice. And uh, I have to leave here in about 15 minutes, so I'm going to try still for a little bit. And if I happen to get one, I'll put it in here someplace. All right, guys? But until the next shot.